Okay, I don't know if you guys know what I was in such a hurry about there, but a friend of... Son of a gun. We gave you meds, Bruno. You're supposed to be feeling better. Damn it, Bruno. Okay, I guess we need to get it warmer in here with another heater, if possible. Where was I? Oh yeah, a f friend of mine told me that that clock up there when you're scavenging, when it gets into the red, that's like your last hour. So, uh, I guess you only have till five. Damn it, Bruno. Let's go try and add some fuel to the fire here. We need some more fuel. Okay. Good to know. Let's make ourselves... Ten fuel. Slightly sick, right? Okay. Get into bed. Pavel. You rush over here. Looks like we uh, have food in the traps. That's good. I can't believe Bruno's doing the whole, oh, I'm sick thing. You get into bed. We can get Marco to sleep after you. Okay, the fuel's almost ready. Pavel. Why don't you go ahead and put some bait in there, huh? That'll work out. Yeah, Marco, I know you're tired. Go put some fuel in the fire, though. We'll let Marin sleep first. And uh, we'll let you sleep before you head on out. I'd prefer not to give Bruno even more meds because he's wasting them. I hope we don't have to trade for meds with this guy. No, we're not going to. We have enough stockpile. What do you have on you? Okay, Franco, my friend. You have scrap, which we require, and sugar, which we require. Hmm. Nothing else that we really require. Okay. Let's go ahead and give you Wood's probably pretty valuable now. Hmm. Let's give him this damaged vest. And... What else do we have? Oh, we could probably use some coffee. What if we load you up with wood? You won't do it. Try harder. What if you take back some scrap? Oh, come on. Wood's got to be valuable in winter. And we can get more wood easily. We do need this scrap. So let's deal. We need more scrap. We could really use that coffee. We're starting to run out of it, which is going to make Marin kind of upset. Hmm. Bottle of booze. Bunch of wood. Very generous. Give us some smokes. Put 
some smokes back. Put a scrap back, take a smoke. So it's that scrap that's holding it back, the deal now. Okay. So the bottle of booze and the wood, and you'll give us the rest of your scrap except for one. Some smokes for Bruno, and some coffee for Marin. What else do you have? Nothing that I can't get myself. Deal. Thank you very much, sir. You were incredibly helpful. Go put some more fuel on the fire. Okay, Pavel, what are you up to? Check the radio. Maybe the cold spell's gonna end. Shortage of water. Death takes a toll. Music. Mm. Classic music. Cold, unfortunately, higher temperatures are not expected over the next couple of days. Well, that's exactly what I didn't want to hear. Damn it, Bruno. Why'd you have to get sick again, I guess? Because the way they said it, it sounds like you recovered during the night and then came back down with it. So, forgive me if I'm a little pissy that that's how the med thing worked out. Okay, now get some sleep. You get up here, Marin. I want you to do some wonders with the scrap we just got. I need you to make a simple heater. And put it over here with the other heater. <sighs> I'm not happy about it, but it's what we're doing. Bruno, get up for a bit. Go make us some moonshine. I know you're sick, bud. But we're going to be taking care of that. We're going to get the area nice and toasty for you. Can we upgrade this? Not enough scrap, to. Okay. How much of this can we make? Go right ahead and make three, Bruno. Marin. Pop some fuel into both of the heaters there. Seriously. Two he okay. Okay, good. Good. Things are getting toasty. Get back to sleep, Bruno. Now's not the time for your smoking bullshit. Head over here quickly, Marn. We have an axe. We don't have a shovel. Make us a shovel real quick. Good job, Marin. Good job. Okay, now. Hopefully we still have enough time. Make us another axe, please. I'm going to take out the one that we have and uh, start chopping some things tonight. That's my plan.
Good job, good job, Marin. Marco is back. Go put a little fuel on the fire there. Get it in. Ah, uh, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Okay. Bruno, try and sleep off that cold without using any more of our medicine. Pavel, you sleep too, I guess. Marin, you stand guard. Marco, let's get you scavenging. I want you to go back to the semi-detached house and take the almost used up axe. Do we have any trading supplies? Um, not really. So maybe we'll use the axe a few times trade it and a bit of wood and hope they have some scrap. That's my plan. Because we still need more scrap. Okay. Is there anything around here that we can axe? Anything. Anything axable. We can't we can't axe anything here, huh? Upstairs maybe? Okay, we can axe that. First first let's go down. See what they have to trade though. Just so that I know. See, there's that clock I'm talking about. See, it goes around here. Once I get back up to the top and in, into the red there. Um, I don't know if you can see that. I can barely see that. But anyway, let's talk with this guy. Then you're out of time, so. Oh, he does have scrap. What do you think of this axe, sir? You're interested in it. Okay. Not interested at the moment. I'll be back. Let's head down here. In here, close this. Go hack this up, apparently. Wardrobe looks like it'll have a lot of wood in it. And. Does it? So much! I am very pleased right now. What about down here? being down here, but I don't think they're going to hear me. Very quiet. Very quiet. Let's look over here. Okay. There's nothing except for that thing that he apparently owns, so let's not go there. Now, there was something up on the top floor, I think, to hack. So let's go chop that up and try and trade for some more scrap. Oh wait, backpack. Yeah, I think the axe has got one more use left in it, okay. Let's go. Didn't want to uh, accidentally use up the axe and not be able to trade it. Wood's valuable and all. Especially in the winter like this, I'm guessing. But probably not so much as the axe. Let's grab all that. Oh! 
thank goodness we are stocked up nicely here again. Let's check the tippy top of this roof. Okay. That's all we're going to get, I think. And that's fine. Because the axe would have probably died if we tried to chop anything more anyway. Okay, sir. Let's trade. I've got this axe. You've got this scrap. You've also got some sugar. You've also got some water. Okay, that scrap. Okay. Okay, okay. Oh, this is really the best stuff you've got. That's cool. Okay. Wood. Take back some scrap. Okay, for that wood and the axe, you'll give me that. Hmm. I like that deal. I am a fan of that deal. I'm happy to be a part of this deal. One spot left. We can trade some fuel and wood. Okay. Exit. Sir? How about... It's funny, they don't even want scrap back. That stuff's really valuable. I don't know what they're thinking. What about this wood? And you give us some scrap. Would you give us a part? You would. And then some scrap. But a part. Take back some scrap. Hmm. How about you? How about you take back the parts? We take the scrap. And some coffee, more coffee, a little less scrap, okay. This will set us up on coffee. We've got enough cigarettes, at the actually I don't know if we've got enough cigarettes. Put back some coffee, I just remembered. Bruno goes through cigarettes pretty quick. We take that and put back a cigarette. Okay, put back the coffee. Grab a couple cigarettes. Okay, a couple cigarettes for Bruno. We got some coffee today from the other trader. And the scrap. For the wood. Actually, what if we give you some fuel? Yeah, what if we give you some fuel? Would you then give us some coffee? And another cigarette. No. It's gonna be like that then, huh? One coffee, two cigarettes, three scrap, for four wood and one fuel. Good enough. Good enough. We get the scrap, which we needed. We get the scrap. And, uh... We get some happy stuff for our guys. So anyway, yeah. See this dial up next to the clock? Basically, it starts at the top goes all the way back around here till it gets up into this tiny red area. That's your last hour right there. And then when it gets back up to there, my friend told me that uh, your character gets caught out in the day. He got this during the uh, winter sale too. And the character can just outright die if they get caught out during the day. 
So, I would not like that to happen to Marco. He is a valuable resource. What are we walking away with? Some coffee? Some cigarettes? Oh, that is so much scrap. I'm so happy. A uh, little bit of sugar so we can make some more moonshine for trading. And we're bringing back fuel to feed our furnaces. This is an exciting night. Let's get, let's get back to the house. Hey guys, I just wanted to take a moment to thank you for watching. Seriously, all the views, likes, comments, and subscriptions. I'm amazed by the support and so grateful. I really hope you enjoyed the video. And until next time, may the Force be with you.